South Shore Denver. And uh, here's some more windmills. We, we got a lot closer to them this time, so I thought we would videotape a little more for you. Remember how I said earlier that we'd get a closer shot if we could? Well, this is as close as I've ever been to them. So, ta da! Ta da! We're finishing up getting ready, about to head into Milk Bar, or Club Bar, or Club Milk, whatever it's called, Bar Milk, Club Milk. Well, anyway, first time there, very excited. Hopefully I'm parked in the right place. Once we start going, you'll be able to see something. So, there goes a the motorcycle. It's a really long light. There we go. And I'm driving. about to go through a tunnel. Oh god, I've never driven through a tunnel before. I live in Flatland, this is weird. Take the shades off. I already have. <laughs> no, I just did. Mm, this, Ooh, is, this is cool. This is scary. Awesome. Freaking out, so maybe I'd better take it down a notch. Yes. Let there be light again. Oh, and trees. Now, this is what I'm used to for mountains to look like trees up the side of it and stuff. I've been through it up to mountains. Well, we finally made it to the campsite. <laughs> We're almost two miles up pretty close. Aspen trees and, and of trees. course our cat. <laughs> Had to go camping with him. You can see mountains. Now the option for a slightly more primitive campsite is available, one without the barbecue grill and everything, but I'm not really sure how to find what's okay to camp at and what's not, so we thought we'd go with this pre-planned out site. Also make sure I don't get lost up here. <laughs> <sighs> We're gonna have dinner. And yay! It's kind of cold up here. <laughs> Right. We're in the tent now, getting ready for bed. It's 
a very small tent. Not sure how well you could see anything going on in here. Loki's in his carrier because he couldn't handle the outside. And all he wants is out. Ah, oh, Loki. Good morning from the mountains near Georgetown, Colorado. So I got clarification this morning on how high up we are exactly. I think I think he said 10,990 feet. So pretty high up there. On today's agenda, probably hiking. But nothing too strenuous. It's my first time being up at this altitude. Probably just the easy lake trail. And Loki is having breakfast. And I'm having coffee. Thus far, my two big prizes for the trip are these birds. We have Exhibit A. He fell out of a tree right outside of Roswell Cosmicon. He is a baby. Probably a grackle. And this bird, well, I have no idea what he is, but Pat found him out in the woods. And he's got beautiful wings. And I'm thinking about doing something with those. So, adventures in camping today. Not my adventures, but others' adventures. There was this couple in an RV with a dog. And they come around parked pretty close to us. And come tumbling out of the RV. Because evidently their dog had gotten a hold of the bear mace and made it spray a little bit. And choked them out. I, hopefully it wasn't too much, but I don't think it was. I offered her some water and she took it gladly, but that's gotta hurt. So, lesson for that. Don't let your dogs play with bear mace. So we've now reached the summit of, I hope I'm saying it right, Guanella Pass. And there goes the wind closing my car door. And it is fucking beautiful up here. It's also pretty cool. The sun's intense, but I've been a good girl and put on sunscreen. <laughs> Remind people what month it is? Oh yes. For, for reference, this is July and, and we're close enough that we could walk over there and go find some snow. See, that patch in particular isn't too far. Those patches are a little further, but still walkable. <laughs> Stand over there. Prove you're here. Ha ha. Hi. <laughs> <sighs> I feel like I'm in the set of Lord of the Rings. Or, um, or The Sound of Music, but I prefer Lord of the Rings. Much better. Alright, about to head back down. Last view of the mountain. Beep. Driving to a mountain again. Mountain climbers. Here we got a little piggy, a little hole, and up there we got mountain climbers. This straight draws all the 
crazy thrill seekers, doesn't it? Yep. The craziest thing I've ever seen is somebody street looting on down one of those mountain roads. Here in Denver, there's a Gothic cathedral we're about to pass that I show people. Mm. That's a special kind of stupid. Let's see how close will let me get. Look at him wag his tail. Oh, he made noise at me. There's one more over here. Let's see if he'll let me get any closer before he takes off. See, he's getting ready for his hole. There's a bunch out there, actually, but 